Okay, I'm gonna explain these dynamic stabilizers again and how they work. A friend of mine's got a patent pending on these things for model helicopters. They're called dynamic stabilizers. And what they are, they are wings that aren't bearings here that completely rotate freely. And the object and the way they're supposed to work is when you're in forward flight, the wind is blowing these up this way. And at the same time, the wind from the blades is blowing down on that angle, thus causing the wind to go down and out the back and make the helicopter fly fast. So we're going to see right now if the helicopter flies faster. As you see, I have both of them on here. They're free swinging. It's a little breezy today, but we're going to do a little speed test and see how it works. This is the Blade 400. So here we go. Inverted O. Inverted O. Yeah, that uh, reverse pitch isn't so good there. This is a new uh, Horizon hobby settings. I am uh, not real happy with it. I like my old settings. Very fast. You know it's real smooth. Alright, I gotta bring this thing up. What do you think? <laughs> it's very gusty, but you know what? It's smooth. 
It's very smooth, definitely fast. Definitely fast. I think it's much faster. I do not like the uh, Horizon Hobby settings. I'm gonna, I'm gonna change those back to my own. Uh, but otherwise, they really work really good. I mean, you could see it would hold it. It's nice and stable. I mean, really, pretty good idea. X wrap. Well, that last flight was a little rough. I'm gonna tell you why. My gyro failed. One side of it was coming back real slow, and the other side was as normal, quick. Uh, so what I've done now is I've completely unhooked the gyro. When I learned to fly, we didn't have gyros. So hopefully I can remember how to fly without a crutch. I'm gonna try these, uh, these dynamic stabilizers again, which already have proven to be that they're pretty capable things and I like them a lot. So I've also taken those settings on the uh, spectrum and I've softened up the center still a little bit. I want that to be a little softer in, around the center. So let's go ahead and take flight and see how it works now. Very, no gyro, so it's very sensitive. I need to set it to half rate. I don't know if that actually have a half rate set on this. Well, I do not much. Let me change the half rate. Okay, I set my rudder to 50%. Way too sensitive. tricky it's still a little sensitive on the tail rotor no gyro whatsoever anyway uh, I gotta tell you the dynamic stabilizers were good and I'm comfortable with what I did with the settings on the transmitter um, I should put the gyro back on I'll have to call Horizon see if I can get it fixed 